just landed in Kutakana Airport. Now going to find our ride. had a broken TV, so we asked them for an upgrade, but they said that they are 99% booked. So here we are at our same room, but actually not because I feel like this room is like way better. So this is our room tour. This is the bathroom. I'm like really happy about this room change. Oh, way better bathroom too. Yeah, he, he thinks it's way better too. Oh, bad. And then we have this is the room with the jacuzzi that we're trying to fill right now. And then we have a canopy looking bed, which was way better than the other bed because the other bed didn't even have these canopy things. And then we have a mirror, some snacks. So the other room had like a like a 50 something inch TV, I'm pretty sure. And we kind of sacrificed that for this little tiny little fellow over here. But it's okay because everything else is like way better. Even the bed feels like way softer than like the other one. So I'm so happy. And then we have a bigger living area. Not that we're gonna really be here, but way more roomy. Way more roomy. And check out the view. It's poolside. This is where all the pool parties are at. It's like the main pool. So it's really cool that we get to like have a balcony that like overlooks it. Well, we are at an Italian restaurant that is serving Mexican tonight, buffet style. And this is our actually second round. We forgot to record the first round, but we have some chip and dip here. It's different types of chips, pasta here, some pasta there. We already had our appetizers before this. How's the food so far, baby? <laughs> we just finished our first dinner at our first restaurant. And I decided because I wanted to try all the restaurants to book another restaurant later on today, which is in another hour. So we're trying to kill time. And we found this cute chess board. It's like life size, little the size of me. And we're gonna play a little bit before we go to our reservation at nine o'clock. Dinner part two is seafood bar and grill with some champagne. Salud! All the mixed skewer, it's like different types of meat all hanging and swinging on top of a, I think this is a baked potato. And then he has the steak. We decided to get one pumpkin front. You can't even see, but we're like so freaking full. We just want to go back to our room and relax. I'm full. What would you rate the two restaurants to? Out of 10. First one is 7.5 out of 10. And then? Second one is 7. I'm gonna unwind in our tub and probably watch some Netflix and just chill for the night until tomorrow where we're gonna wake up and uh, explore more of the resort. So, um, good night and see you tomorrow. Literally, I did not start this video when I started eating because I'm basically done eating and he's just finishing up. What do you think about the main buffet dining area and food? I'm like sweating. Like my hair is sticking to my body. I mean, that's Dominican Republic for you. Really, really enjoyed the fruit that they have here in this country. It's like super, super fresh. Mango, the passion fruit. Papaya, and then I had some um, fruit with my yogurt, but 
Yeah, so delicious. I would literally just sit here and eat fruit all day if I could. So this is the infinity pool. That's Brian right there. Trying to be weird. Hey. Welcome to the gymnasium. We just finished the pool. We did a rinse. And now we are here at the gym. You know, because Ryan loves to go to the gym. It's a very small gym. But there's like a bench, some weights, flat pull down machine, and some. Elliptical slash treadmill, that's about it. <laughs> so we're going to do some workouts and then we're probably eating dinner. Peace! Don't mind my wet hair, I just came out of the shower. We are all dressed and ready to go to our second specialty dinner, which is at a um, Asian fusion restaurant called Tao Cat. I ordered the Thai appetizer variety sample thing and then the roll called katana with like red tuna and some stuff, I don't even know. Mm -hmm. And then he ordered the spicy tuna roll with like chipotle mayo mm -hmm. and the ramen, some kind of ramen. katsu ramen. I don't know if this is katsu. But the ambiance is very nice, the lighting is good, the whole place is very nicely organized and the service is good. <laughs> Green tea cake, Mint. lychee Mint. with grenadine, and ice cream. It's probably black and white. Here we are, second lunch. This time we're eating indoors. We're at the buffet, I would say, for our side of the resort. The space is like very nice and it's indoors, so we don't have to deal with birds and like the heat. So we finally got to the beach for the first time. Fish are below us right now. We're like halfway out of the water, which makes no sense at all because we're like so far in and it keeps going too, but everyone seems to be. Literally only halfway deep in. What the heck? I don't understand. So this is how he got me out there. Oh. Carrying me on his back. I'm oh, too short. <laughs> Yo! Oh, you're standing now. Oh no! Oh, thank God. Aww. Hi, Chris. Here's my coffee. It's like banana. Bye, don't get banana. What you got? Crap. It's a coconut crap. Here at the stress 
free zone. Mosquito Central. It's like, okay, well, Brian calls it Mosquito Central, but this is where like all the cabanas are, and there's like hammocks in the hut. Where you can kind of relax and listen to the water. I'm about some pizza here. <laughs> I'm like super tired, which is, I don't know if you can hear, but like, I can barely keep my eyes open. Brian says I need a nap. I think I do. You need a nap. You need a nap. <laughs> Here's an update. Um, <laughs> Brian has diarrhea. Like really bad, really smelly diarrhea. So here's an update. He actually came out of the bathroom alive. I made it boys, I made it, I made it. I'm scared guys, I'm scared, I'm scared. He's like, I don't know if I can eat right now. <laughs> I was like, I wanna eat. So we got our appetizer, this is like, the mahi-mahi fish, and then he got the red tuna fish. I need to eat bread. Some of the bread. I think the bread would help me. Whoa. Just came back from the casino. Um, <laughs> Brian had to go poop in the middle of the casino because like it just comes in waves. And now he just looks like this. So you guys have any recommendations for next time? Because he's drank like a lot of Pepto-Bismol and it hasn't helped him at all. I just told him to get Advil because he has like cramps in his stomach. And I'm like starting him like a hot bath. Cause usually that helps with stomach cramps as well, but we're really limited right now with what we have. We'll see how tonight goes and hopefully it will have gone by tomorrow, but yeah. he's probably not gonna eat until tomorrow when he gets back cause he doesn't want to shit during his excursion. <laughs> yeah. See you guys later, good night.